Welcome back to PVZ Clips, the show where you make the content for me. I'd like to think we all know how this works by now, but just in case you don't, allow me to explain. You send me a clip in your preferred game. I watch the clip. I rate the clip out of five. If you get five, then congrats you well done. If you get one, Stinks! you don't want to end up in there. Just quickly before we uh, get on with the show, I uh, just want to say I'm sorry. I know it's been almost a week. It's been kind of a hectic one and I've been getting some stuff finalized and sorted out with the second channel. That is now done. We are now back on this channel full time. But as I said, I'm going to be leaving that channel up and all the content that's on it. And there is now a playlist on this channel where you can go and watch the Pokemon Scarlet series if you want. If you enjoyed the Pokemon Sword series that I did or you've enjoyed any of the other Pokemon series that I've done in the past, I promise you you'll enjoy this one make sure you go and check it out clips love the vids wolfie keep it up here's my first submission for this series i've been watching for several years now i just never had a twitter account well john yoshi cena i'm expecting big things i mean you get two stars just for the mech base z mech skin oh let's get it let's get it okay not bad not bad Wait, am I seeing that kill feed correctly? Oh, he got three different chompers. Never mind the oak, he wasn't even part of the equation. My man is out here contributing to the extermination of Piranha Peak. Well, I said don't disappoint, and disappoint you didn't. Oh. I'm thinking like, imagine he could have got a Hadouken in there. Ignore what I just said. Okay, let's just break this down. First of all, forget the Hadouken comment. That just... Clip ain't the best quality. I missed how many he actually got with that. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. And bear in mind, seven. Most of these are chompers. Eight, nine. Let me tell you why this clip is an easy five stars. Not only did he bag the nine kills... But the fact that you managed to get in there with that many chompers and just get through the whole bunch without getting spike weeded or burrowed or something, that is the easiest five stars I've ever given. Ultimate trap? Welcome to the Hall of Shag. Been sending clips in since the days of messaging through Xbox. That's commitment. None have ever got shown. If you watch this, please edit Doom music over it. Thank you, and destruction to Nightcap mains. Well, I'm a Nightcap main, so that already leaves a bad taste in my mouth. Uh, let's, let's humor this clip. Let's, let's see what he's got. He is playing soldier. I didn't see how many nightcaps were sitting on that thing. I want to say, like, far too many. Is he about to just... He did get the last one as well. I was just thinking that. Can I edit Doom music over that or am I going to get copyrighted? I'll tell you what, I'll give you the next best thing. I'm not going to lie to you. Had it been me and I'd spotted that, I would have just jump shotted the whole thing just to see how many I could get with that one rocket. I like the idea of the stink cloud. And then he does pretty much dust bin the lot of them. Can I just say as a nightcap main, I'm appalled at how poor this organization was what were you all defending on that platform that was so important free brazzer subscription listen i can't be biased just because i like the mushroom i will be fair you can have your five stars fair enough welcome to the hall of shag friend Yeah, shot his load a little bit there, didn't he? Apparently, this is supposed to be a 1v1. I don't know why people do 1v1s in the backyard. Why would you not do it in private match? Because doesn't the backyard have that thing where it like, gives you armor when you're on low health, so you take less damage? I don't know. It just seems a bit counterintuitive, but I'm nitpicking. Perhaps rather than picking a better location, I could suggest picking a better opponent, because I don't know what the fuck he was trying to do there. But I'm fair enough. We are swimming in the BFN clips today. That's a good cancel. Is that a double cancel? Oh, he got the nightcap as well. Okay, now that wasn't bad. That was not bad at all. And he's rocking the skin. Good, that's what we like to see. Should just be compulsory that everyone who plays All-Star has to wear this. I think, personally, but... He was going in for the Feng Fu as well. I could hear that. 
Yeah, he was going for it. They came at my guy with the double cheese sandwich. He just goes, nope. I'll tell you what, you know, I feel like looking back on the last episode I did on this, I was a little bit harsh on some of the clips. There were definitely a few clips in there that I could have given five, but I didn't. I'm going to be a little bit more generous this week. I'm going to give this one five as well. I've never seen someone pull off a double stack burrow and fung fu cancel. With a BFN imp punt, I hasten to add, which is just, you know, BFN imp punt just doesn't hit the same. Neo, I'm not sure if I should say welcome to the Hall of Shag or welcome to the Matrix, but welcome. More of a mod clip, but I thought I'd share a taste of what's capable. All right, you have my attention. Oh, that was a bot. He made the computer do a jump shot. I like it. I like the way he clarifies it as well. I'm thoroughly impressed, sir. Oh, the flying Dutchman. Yeah, it's nice when it actually works. For some reason, the physics of the game just kind of goes out the window as soon as you're standing on top of one of these things. I never really understood it. Maybe one of these days we'll find a way to consistently pull it off. Not strictly sure that's who it was supposed to hit. We take those. I mean, look at this guy. What a good teammate. What a noble teammate. Sacrificing himself for the greater good. The greater good. I mean, he just didn't. He had no idea what was happening. What's happened there is he's gone like, yes, I'm going to land this swoop slam. I'm going to get this kill. And then he's just blown up as soon as he's gone into the air. He probably logged off and didn't play again for the rest of the day. Okay. I'm going to guess at that particular moment in time, probably the best thing you could have done. Or, you know, use your bot blaster. There was that too. But I like the way he saw that opportunity. A bit of disrespect. There's one thing I like, it's a bit of disrespect. You can have three for that. Is he inside the cabin? I didn't even know that was possible. Oh, I think we found a new strategy for guard knops. His mate's trying to get in there and he can't. Oh, I didn't even know you could do that. Learn something new every day. It's been a while since I've seen a good shrimp net clip. Yeah, that's it. How many? Okay, not bad. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, okay, I'm just... I was thinking like, okay, you got a triple off the mech. That's not too bad. Then my man just went crazy. My man just turned into a human aimbot. See that one more time. Dude, that looks so clean. You don't see shrimp very often. Extra respect for that. Have yourself five stars, sir. Indomitus, Rex. Welcome to the Hall of Shag. I mean, we could just pretend like you were trying to hit the garlic drone all along. Someone managed to hit it with stink cloud as well. Wait a minute. How did that stink cloud get up there? I know I'm not really focusing on what matters here. I'm just thinking like not only was someone able to jump shot that drone, but someone was also able to hit it with a stink cloud. That drone is just in shambles. You know what happened when that drone got destroyed? The cactus sitting way off in the back over there somewhere. He just sat there for a minute. He just sat there like shit. Don't know if I can say anyone's ever jump shot my garlic drone. Probably because I never used the garlic drone. That was an interesting clip. I forgot how annoying that crown was. I'm on, I'm on your six. Unstoppable. I 
can't stand it. It's so annoying. I'm trying to remember some of the other shit it used to say. I mean, I wasn't even really paying attention to the clip. What even happened? Just beat a few people up. Yeah, I mean, it's not too bad. I just can't stand that crown. It just never shuts up. As soon as I saw the beam bomb, as soon as I saw it, I knew exactly what was going down. Oh, I hate that so much. I, You just knew the second you saw it on your screen, you knew exactly what was going to happen. Oh, it hurts to watch. Is it unethical to report someone for resing you? Because believe me, I've thought about it. I need a gang beast clip. Someone has to have sent me a gang beast clip. Yeah, now we're talking. <laughs> No way, he's still in! If he goes on to win this, wow, I can't believe he lived that. That is legit. Yeah, Kofi Kingston in the Royal Rumble. I was just thinking that. Bro was like an inch from the floor. I don't know exactly how it works. I assume that if any part of you touches the floor, you're just gone. I mean, does it count if your cape's touching the floor? Someone said rate yourself in this clip. I'm playing Fortnite. It's going to be one star by default. I just got myself killed. Yep, you were very good at that. Go, get through there right now. Well Thank done. You. It's supposed to be the golden scar! None of the shots are landing. None of the shots are landing! Is this thing an assault rifle or a potato gun? Do you know what? I think that's the last time I pick up a golden scar. Genuinely, I think that's the last. Yeah, no, that's pretty much true. I don't think I ever picked up one after that. I would deliberately stick with the blue M4 after that happened. I'd like wouldn't even pick up a scar. I ought to give it one just for how abysmal it is, but for the entertainment value alone, I'll give it two. Also, can I just put this one to bed once and for all? I'm not wearing lipstick. Bullshit. Yes, I know what it looks like. Listen, man's lighting was not very good back in the day. The setup was shit. It's not lipstick. You can leave me alone now. And I think that's where we're going to call it a day. Hope you've enjoyed this uh, latest installment of PVZ Clips. If you want to send me clips in the future, you can go and follow me on Twitter at WolfyPlaysClips. I normally tweet out when I want clips, so go and follow it and then just keep an eye out for that. If you enjoyed the video, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Stay tuned for the next one. Till next time.